News starts now with breaking news. That breaking news from the Charleston County School District. The district has settled $1 million claims filed by the families of eight alleged victims who say they were molested by a district employee at Dunstan Elementary School. Marvin Gathers worked for the school district from 2000 to 2007 and again from 2010 to 2016. He was charged with molesting two children at the school, but he died in 2017 before those cases could go to trial. A Live 5 News investigation found that the school district and police were investigating Gathers in 2014 for child pornography. Yet, documents show he was allowed to continue working at Dunstan while under investigation. In fact, he was promoted, named Employee of the Year in 2015, awarded a new iPad, and given a district vehicle to drive. Police affidavits state during that time he was allegedly molesting two young boys at the school. After Live Five's initial reporting, several more families came forward saying their children had been molested by Gathers. In total, nine minor children brought claims against the district. Eight have settled for a million dollars apiece, with insurance paying one million dollars total, and the district the other seven million. Three of the lawsuits are in federal court, waiting for approval by a federal judge, and the other five have been approved by a state judge. One claim was settled in 2018 for three hundred thousand dollars. Attorney Mark Pepper, who represents five of the eight families who settled for a million dollars, released the following statement saying, quote, while it's unfortunate that these tragic events ever occurred, we appreciate the Charleston County School District's willingness to amicably resolve these claims without the children having to relive the events during a lengthy and emotional trial. Being sexually abused as a child can result in a lifetime of suffering, and these settlements will allow them to continue the healing process into their adulthood." End quote. The Charleston County School District said in a statement, the district hopes this settlement puts this unfortunate matter behind us. Life 5 Investigates first uncovered this case in 2018 and reported on the allegations and lawsuits in the years that followed. Here's a timeline of what happened leading up to these settlements. It all started in 2014 when Charleston School's IT workers detected child pornography on employee Marvin Gather's school laptop. Gathers was a student concern specialist working in the Dunstan Elementary Counseling Office in North Charleston. The district turned over his laptop to police. Gathers wrote a letter apologizing but denying the porn involved children. It took detectives two years before they analyzed Gathers' computer because of limited resources. Meantime, we found out the district had not fired or suspended Gathers but promoted him and named him Employee of the Year. And Mr. Gathers does some unbelievable things for kids and with kids. Gathers was later arrested for the porn in 2016. Two children came forward saying he molested them at school while the police investigation was underway. My child would have been safe. This whole situation could have been avoided. He was fired and arrested but denied the allegations. He died in 2017 before he could be tried, but we uncovered a $300,000 settlement between the Charleston County School District and one of the victims. After our story started airing, as many as five more potential victims came forward. Lawmakers and community activists were outraged. It made me angry. It made me sick to my stomach. We are infuriated and we want something done immediately. 